So maybe you feel like you're losing your spark. That's okay. It doesn't mean that what you want isn't gonna happen, but see, your mind is gonna tell you that. Your mind is gonna tell you, oh, now you're not as bubbly as you used to be. Now you're not as playful as you used to be. Now you're not as animated as you used to be. I used to shoot videos and I was like in your face. <laughs> you know, I was being myself, but that's where I was at the time. And then when I started deciding to calm down, I had a thought that told me, now you're not gonna be a big deal anymore because people are gonna think you're boring. And I was like, that's okay, because I know that I need to let go. I accept my fate. I have to make peace with what the universe has in store for me. I have to make peace with my destiny. And most people don't want to let go. Most people want to hold on to the idea of who they thought they would become. But if you're, if you're trying and you're working too hard to hold on to something, that's not for you. That's the universe signaling you that you need to now let go. So it's a dance, you know, you have to discipline yourself to constantly develop yourself within a, a certain level. And then once you get to the next level, you got to drop the previous level. The issue is when you're at the new level, you just started that level. So you don't know where you're going. So you're navigating the unknown but you still have to have faith and you still have to have the bravery to let go of the previous level. It's called reinvention. So anytime something starts to feel like effort, that is a sign from the universe that you need to let it go because it's time for an upgrade and you need to, to be okay with what that upgrade looks like. If it means that, let's say, I'm not going to be known for what I do, I have to be okay with that. Would it suck? Kind of. But even that thought alone is me holding on. You see what I'm trying to say? So your true, true calling is you. That's your true calling. Is the, the higher version of you that is so intelligent that you can't see with your physical eyes, that's continuously working with you, guiding you to get you to the next level of you. And if it, at, if it matches this world, wonderful. What a blessing. What a blessing. And if it doesn't match this world and it's something that you're preparing for that's not of this world, then what a blessing.